Hi, it's Suzanne here, and I'm going to show you how to assemble the new Quiet Fire Park Bench Card in a Box. It comes in a variety of designs, and today we're going to use the wedding version to demonstrate how this is assembled. So get all your pieces, cut them out in the colors of your choice, and then we'll start assembling them. So layer all those little bits and pieces that you can. It's much easier to do them flat than it is later on when the box is assembled. I like to use 65 pound cardstock for the detail pieces and I use 80 pound cardstock for the box shapes. Now this is the assembly of the box and you want to burnish down all those score lines with the bone folder. Add some adhesive to the tab and fold into the box shape. And there you have it. That's the start. Then there's the insert that's in the middle. There's only one in this particular card in a box. So add adhesive to the tabs and fold them right back so that they stay back so it makes it a little bit easier to insert the tabs and position them inside the box. And you can see it folds flat. Then you could add a few more embellishments. Now we're going to fold up the park bench. And you want to fold, there's lots of score lines in this. So you're going to fold the back up carefully. And then you're going to go to the sides and you're going to fold those in. There's two score lines there and then there's part of the seat that folds down there and you're going to repeat that on the other side and you can just finger fold this. Okay, unfold it. Now there's an extra little fold that doesn't go all the way across and it forms the seat of the bench. It doesn't go all the way across because the arms of the bench don't fold where the seat folds. So just carefully finger fold that score line and you'll see the seat start to take shape and you can see there's no fold along there. That's good. And then there's two more little folds to finish and that's in the arms. And now it's starting to take shape so you just need a little bit of adhesive there and there and don't put it all over that tab because part of that tab actually shows is the seat. And there we go. How cute is that? It's a little bench. Now to add the bench to the box, you just want the adhesive in a couple of places. In the middle of the top really helps you position this because you can still swivel it around. It gives you a little bit of open time just to get it in the right place. Then come over to the side and line up the bottom of the bench with the bottom of the box. Add some adhesive to the other side in the same place and stick that down and there you have it. Oh, so cute. Add the extra little embellishments. It 
double thickness of foam tape makes things stand out. And there you have it. How cute! So you see the box still folds flat, but the bench doesn't. Now, in the interest of full disclosure, I actually altered that cutting file so that the forever section is lower down and you can see the wedding bells better. Too cute! You can write a special message on the side panels or you can leave them white or change the color if you wish. Thanks for dropping in and watching this. I hope you enjoy making the park bench card in a box. See you in the next tutorial. Bye!